Hello and welcome to this Dr. Ross Maths key skill video on converting from a decimal with a single recurring digit to a fraction. And we want to convert from 0.4 recurring, I'll explain what that means in a second, to a fraction. Now what does that recurring dot mean? It just means that that 4 is repeated. So the method I use to convert from a recurring decimal to a fraction is to just give this a value x, so let's call it x, and we write out this 0.4 recurring with that digit repeated. So as I said, the 4 with the recurring dot just means 4, 4, 4, 4, 4. So let's just write out that digit a few times and put dot, dot, dot. Now the generic method for this is to identify how often this digit is repeating. Well we can see it's repeating every one digit. And if that happens, what we do is we times both sides of the equation by 10. So we've got 10x, and if we times this by 10, then it moves the decimal point once, so we get 4.444. And I'm going to put the decimal point here in the same place, because it's going to make the next step easier to do. So try and make sure that decimal point is the same place. Why do we times by 10? Well, I'll explain in the next video. Because if it was to repeat every, say, two digits, we times by 100, every three digits times by 1,000, etc. Now the next bit is where the magic happens. We just subtract these two equations. So we do the second equation, subtract the first. If I was to label these, I want to do 2 minus 1. So if we do 10x minus x, that just gives you 9 lots of x. Now if I subtract these, can you see that if we have the 4 minus 4, 4 minus 4, 4 minus 4, these are just going to be zeros. So we can see this is going to cancel. And we're just left with a 4 minus 0, which is just 4. So we've got 9x is 4, and then to get x on its own, we divide both sides of the equation by 9, and we get x is 4 over 9. And there we go, we've managed to convert x from its original recurring decimal form to fractional form. And if we just check down our calculator, we do 4 divided by 9, press equals, it'll say 4 ninths. But then if you press the SD key, it will actually show the 0.444444. So we know that we've got it right.